Players are now enjoying the off season, but a local band that shares many of the same fans is just warming up. Right, we've talked about it against Christy Olds here. Christy, many people are surprised to hear that the band is actually from southwestern Connecticut. In fact, they are called the Zambonis. And if you've ever been to a hockey game or a skating rink, you know that's the ice resurfacing machine. So you can understand why many people assume the group comes from Canada. They now have a solid base of fans all across the U.S. And it all started right here with one man's desire to rock the rink. Oh, man. Dave Snyder loves hockey. Pull this guy. Luckily, his work gives him a great view. You may have seen him at Sound Tiger Games. All right, folks, over here in Section 102, it's Dave. Hey, it's great to see you, man. Hey, nice to see you. Good. I love the fans. That's what I love the most. Perfect. And obviously is comfortable with a mic in his hands, although he prefers a smaller stage. The Zambonis, of course. What's not to love about a band that combines music and hockey? Two dispersed elements coming together in a crescendo of violence and noise. They're perfect together. Schneider is the captain of the Zambonis, a band where Every song has to do with hockey. I was always a hockey fan, always a music fan, and luckily the worlds have collided. And I will be your captain, me through all that happens. But for Schneider, it all makes sense. You can put that way on me. I'm not a big NASCAR fan, you know? Chess songs just don't cut it. They don't have the energy. Um, it's just what happened. It's hockey. It's hockey song. A band that writes songs only about hockey is obviously a huge underdog. It's like an under poodle. These underdogs are now all stars. They've been making music for 20 years. The songs are good and they're smart. And they'll get stuck in your head. You don't think you're internalizing these songs and then you're humming a melody or singing a weird lyric later. Man, that is a good song. We have a lot of fun. We're serious about the music. We love music. We love hockey. And it works. Thank you! The Zambonis have been featured in the New York Times, Sports Illustrated, and on ESPN. They also played at the NHL All-Star Game twice. The band recently released its seventh album called Five Minute Major in D Minor. For more information, go to news12.com. And they even have their own mascot. You saw him dancing around there at one point. His name is Hockey Monkey. Ah, so. I like that line about being not an underdog, but an under poodle. Exactly. <laughs> they really are. Thank you. In this evening's News 12 Connecticut Fairville County Business Journal report, shares of Apple stocks skyrocketed today after yesterday's blowout earnings report. Apple says it sold 35 million iPhones from January to March, twice as many as a year ago, and it sold nearly 12 million iPads during the same period. That was below forecast, but still two and a half times last year's first quarter sales. The company says much of its growth has come from sales in Asia. Hello. Apple and Hockey Rocks.